Hi folks, David Creative Craft House to show you our double maglock box. This is a beautiful box, uh, quite large, very heavy, very rugged, beautiful mahogany panels here. It's a solid mahogany, um, maple top. Um, probably the culmination of our what we can do with our skills and creativity, at least at this time. Uh, just a terrific box. Now, the box, uh, as you see it here, has a top with the butterfly and numbers, but as a standard with this box, you can specify what you would like that top to look like within our abilities to have artwork, at least. These letters, these numbers could be letters, and uh, they could be symbols, again, if we have the artwork, and here's some examples, uh, because these panels can come out and they can be changed. And if you're in an escape room, uh, you can change them uh, yourselves. It's very easy. But here's an example. This one has uh, symbols. This one has numbers. This is kind of an odd one that has numbers. But there could be letters, and perhaps the solution to open this box would involve those letters. Um, we do have a lot of artwork, by the way. Um, and anything that's available, we need vector artwork in black and white. Anything that's available on the internet, um, we have, and of course, any of our picture frame puzzles, uh, there's just hundreds of different uh, features or designs that we have available. Now, to open this box, um, you will be given uh, some, these are also a mahogany, and we've embedded, you see a magnet on the other side. These have to be placed in the correct position. Now, this box, and, and is, as is the standard, has comes with four magnets. Could be three, could be five. Uh, you have one chance in 492 if you just place them randomly. You notice they'll stick on the numbers here. Just I just place them randomly. I have one chance in 492 of being able to open the draw here. And that didn't work. Now this one I know we set it up so that we could remember it. And by the way, these combinations can be changed and you can specify what you'd like. And you can change them later yourself, believe it or not. Um, so if the if the uh, magnets are placed in in this position, I believe that's the combination. Mm, I'm wrong. <laughs> there we go. The the draw will open. Okay. Now that's pretty cool. We've we've opened the box. But you know what? There's something special about this box, and you won't see anything at this point but if I take this draw out and I look inside oh, it just looks like an empty panel empty space but there's a little lever here I looked real careful I don't know if you can see it here and if I move this letter lever to the left this side panel will come off and if I move it to the right, there's a draw. It's a hidden draw in this. And it just swings open. So this is actually a two-level puzzle box with a hidden draw that you might not even discover if you didn't know the secret. Okay, then this will go back on. Now, how does this thing work? Well, let me give you an idea. Um, here's a box partially made. What we've done is, in each one of these um, holes here, uh, and which are under the cover, there's going to be a magnet. It's, going to fit. it's a nice, strong magnet. It's going to fit right in those holes. Four of them will have little pins. They're stainless steel uh, pins that will um, extrude from the magnet, extend from the magnet, and fit into those holes. And they those pins will drop into one of the holes in the draw. When it's in place, you, when one of those pins falls into the holes, you won't be able to pull the draw open. Okay. Until such time as the magnets are positioned correctly, and they will pull up the magnets with the pins and allow you to open the draw. So if I take this, these magnets off, the, mag the, pins, the pins fall into the holes, and now it won't open. Now, one of the beauties of this is that, that by removing a few screws, 
you can slide this panel off uh, and you will see the magnets here. You can take them out, just take another magnet and it'll lift out, and reposition the magnets that have the pins on them such that you can change the combination yourself. This might be particularly valuable for escape rooms uh, where at some point in time they, they do want to change the combination in case the combination gets out into the public or something. And of course you could change the, the theme by ordering uh, multiple tops or replacement tops if they got uh, scratched or damaged as sometimes happens in escape rooms. This box is particularly rugged. We did design it with escape rooms in mind. Um, very, it, I mean, you, no puzzle box will take unlimited force, uh, but this one is really put together solidly. Uh, it's quite heavy. I'm not sure what it weighs here. Uh, four pounds, maybe three, four pounds. It's very heavy, um, and it is something that should uh, definitely last a lifetime. Very unique. It's our own design. Um, and nearly all the work on the design and the construction of this, of this was done by our own uh, Robert Justiano. A really uh, incredible craftsman when it comes to uh, when it comes to wood and creativity. So I hope it's something you can enjoy. I made right here in uh, Hudson, our Hudson, Florida shop. Thanks very much.